This is a load of barnacles. I heard that this is the German term 3, and I think it's one of the most broken premiums in the entire game. I did make a video on it before, but I feel like my video quality wasn't great then, so I'm redoing it. Basically, it is fully stabilized, has a 5 second reload, and a coaxial 30mm autocannon. It's pretty insane, so let's take it out and see how busted this is. This is definitely one of the ugliest tanks I've ever seen. <laughs> Dude, I love the 30 mil on this. It's probably my favorite weapon in the entire game. It doesn't have a ton of pen because it doesn't get Sabo, but the SAP does so much damage. It's ridiculous. How? How did that ricochet? What? Uh, there we go. There is an IT PSV90 apparently, which is uh, very scary. Cool. How is he still alive? I might have jinxed him. Buddy, if you if you use your tow hook, uh, okay. I was going to say if you use your tow hook, I can uh, I can help you. Over half of our team is gone already. Jeez Louise, man. That is, in fact, a man. He's not dead. Okay, I think that ITPSV is finally dead. Thank God. Even more unbalanced than this. I didn't need to use a heat round on that. I think this might be a full down tier, although we do have a Rakaten on our team, so... <laughs> It'll probably steal all the kills. I'm not playing very intelligently right now. Where is their team at right now? Uh, <laughs> excuse me. What? There we go. I was going to say that, uh, I feel like that T-44 should definitely be dead right about now. At least 105 heat seems to do a lot of damage. Unlike, uh, 90 mil heat. Don't know where I got shot from. I suspect it might have been a teammate because it didn't damage us. How did he not die to the, uh, autocannon? That was not very smart of you. The, the cannon, so dumb. The auto cannon, I mean. <laughs> Hello, are you alive? I suspect that you are. Oh my god. Yeah, 105 heat seems to do a lot of damage. Oh no, you don't. Uh... <laughs> what the hell? How did that not do more damage? You know, I think that's a, a fairly light vehicle. You would expect it to overpressure from heat, but... I don't know, I'm not an expert. This Rakaten is uh, not very good with his ammo, I don't think. I keep hearing him fire relentlessly and he doesn't get any kills. <laughs> Honestly, if I saw that damn thing in my living room, I'd stomp on it until it was a small brown stain. Cheeky little rascal. What the hell is that thing? Oh. Um. There we go. Oop. My bad. It boggles my mind that this is the same BR as the T-54E1. You know, the unstabilized US tank with the same reload, worse mobility, and no autocannon. Yes, it has better armor, but how much is that worth when anything can pen it anyway? How... What? How did that AML survive that first burst? Um... I'm so sick of these people! You know! 
He was completely silent until he was on top of me. I was going to be so mad if that didn't kill him. I am contemplating just jaying out so I can have a fresh crew. Um, is it just me or did that not detonate on the bush in front of him, but it still killed him? I was wondering how that wasn't killing him, but then I remembered that I was shooting inside the vehicle and the crew are outside. Unfortunately, elevation is one thing that Term 3 is not very good at. Oh, it, <laughs> it took so long for my driver to start turning. Oh, that's definitely a guy. Oh! <laughs> I didn't think that would kill him. Uh-oh. Turn the turret quickly. Someone is attempting to shoot me currently. Oh, it was a Saidam. Does that even get AP? There was something else attempting to shoot me. Damn. What did I hit? Okay, well, at least we got the PT before we died. There is no way this thing should be as survivable as it is. I mean, just look at the turret. On one side, you've got a full rack of ammo. And on the other side, you've got two crew members back to back. Um. Okay. T55 AMs do scare me quite a bit. Uh. Okay, that is uh, no good. Ah, uh, that's a bush. Wait. What? How did... I don't think a heat jet can travel 600 meters, Gaijin. <laughs> that has to be just a visual bug, right? Where you shoot through the bush, but it still acts like it detonates. There we go. Is that a Magok Hydra? Yeah, it is. I think he just got hit in the rocket rack. <laughs> uh, I am very tempted, but I also can't shoot that high. That was a joke. I don't condone team killing. What did my turret just do? <laughs> it looked like it was hypnotized by the tank in front of me. Surely if I just run right in, I won't get shot immediately, right? Um, what the hell did that? <laughs> I, I didn't know that was a locust when I went to shoot it. Oh, that's a guy, I believe. Let's see if we can catch him off guard. Yep, I forgot this thing actually has really nice gun depression. It's like 12 degrees, I think. Not enough to see that guy currently, however. There we go. What the hell is that thing? How did a Term 3 lose to a CEV? Um. How is he still alive that hit his ammo? What the hell? How did that not kill him? Thank God, dude. Finally. Let's go, 122. No fear. I'm gonna wait so we don't get collateral. If I try to, uh... Yeah. There we go. I am close to running out of ammo. We're doing pretty alright. We've got six kills so far, which is pretty good considering it's a full up tier. In case you didn't know by the XM. What the hell are you guys shooting? Oh, it's an IS-7. Uh, that is not what I intended to destroy. There we go. 
I'm gonna say, if I can't kill him, I'm gonna cry. Definitely hear a bad guy. I most certainly did. I feel like I'm gonna get bombed in a few seconds. That hasn't happened to me yet, this video. I just need one more kill and that'll be enough for a nuke. Well, hopefully that artillery gets him. I don't wanna try and uh, push an SPAA. Our armor is not that good. Uh, is this... Is this XM here? Okay, no. No, he was not. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, it's not really unfortunate because it's the end of the game, and I did get the nuke, but... Yeah. I wanted at least one more kill. This really is just the perfect vehicle, I think. It's very fast, has two very good guns that can counter pretty much anything. Its gun handling is pretty great. Really, the only thing it doesn't have going for it is armor, which isn't that important for my playstyle. Hold up. There we go. I found that BTRs are also very satisfying to kill. It's not a very good vehicle, but it is quite annoying. I just realized I made a grave mistake. I brought heat on Japan. Um, apparently the autocannon did not have enough pen to kill that Object 120. That's good to know. There we go. Huh? Huh. Never seen that before. Ow, my engine. I thought heat jets were always eaten by the engine. Is that... Don't tell me. <laughs> Why an M2? I'm a genius. Okay, they really wanted me dead, apparently. So yeah, that is the Term 3. Obviously a very, very powerful tank. I thought the damage with heat might be inconsistent, but it was pretty good, I think. Combine that with the fast reload, the fact it's fully stabilized, the great gun handling, it is just an absolute menace. So yeah, I think it should probably go up a bit in BR. Anyway, if you guys have suggestions for video topics, leave them in the comments, and I'll see you on the next one.